to read a book. Hi everyone, here's another Amelia Bedelia book. And remember that book called Amelia Bedelia Bakes Off? Well, get ready for the treat again, because Amelia Bedelia is back, and she has brought so many sweet treats for you. And if you like my reading, please like, subscribe, and share. And definitely don't forget to hit the bell icon. Let's get started. Amelia Bedelia Takes the Cake by Herman Parrish. Pictures by Lean Avril. Amelia Bedelia and her classmates were having a bake sale. The bake sale would raise money to help the library at their school buy new books. So they are making so many posters. Support our library. My mom helped me make an angel food cake, said Angel. Amelia Bedelia thought everything Angel ate was angel food. I made chocolate chip brownies, said Chip. Of course, said Amelia Bedelia. She was excited to share the super chewy brownies she had made. Just then, Wade arrived with brownies. So did Dawn and Holly and Heather. Teddy and Clay brought brownies too. So did the rest of the class. Guys, said Chip, this is a bake sale, not a brownie festival. Miss Edwards, their teacher, arrived with a big glass of jar to hold the money from the sale. My goodness, she said, I've seen lots of mix-ups, but this takes the cake. Please do not take our cake, said Amelia Bedelia. It's the only one we've got. Don't worry, I'll buy the cake, said Miss Edwards. I have plans for it. Thank you, said Angel. She put the money from Miss Edwards in the big glass jar. Go ahead and set it up, said Miss Edwards. I'll be back. Amelia Bedelia and her classmates stared at stacks of brownies. Maybe we should put, a, put out a few at a time, said Dawn. Teddy and Clay and Teddy gave her idea a try. That, look, that looks weird, said Wade. We did a lot of baking, but I do not think we will sell a lot. Wade is right. That is really strange. But I know, said Amelia Bedelia, let's put them all out at once. The brownies were all square. They were all about the same size. But the light cakey ones were tall. The dark chewy ones were short. Some had flaky tops. Others were smooth and flat. Teddy had put icing on his batch. Holly had dusted her batch with powdered sugar. The bakers stood back to admire their work. That looks amazing, said Penny. I've never seen so much chocolate. It's cool, said Skip. They're the same, but also not the same. Wow, it looks good. Cliff squinted his eyes. Too bad we can't make one big brownie, he said. We could set a world record for the biggest brownie. Amelia Bedelia squinted her eyes. She could see what Cliff saw. She also saw something else. She began moving brownies, here and there and everywhere. 
is Quentin means weaking. Amelie Bedelia stood back to admire her work. Now that is one big brown E, she said. Everyone laughed and cheered. That is amazing, said Angel. We need new signs, said Clay. Everyone got to work. Biggest brown E in town? Bell with chocolate? That's so silly. Brown E books equal yum. Yeah. Homemade goodies. Biggest brown E in the world. Yum. Soon kids from other classes came to the bake sale. Parin parents and babysitters stopped by. So did teachers and bus drivers. The principal and the school nurse visited too. Everyone wanted a taste of the biggest brownie in town. Just like everyone wants to see my reading. Wow. Wow, said Miss Edwards. I've been to many bake sales, but this really does take the cake. Take the cake. No, you bought the cake, said Amelia Bedelia. I did, said Miss Edwards. I've I thought the best bakers in town might like a snack when their work is done. Thanks, Miss Edwards, said Angel. She was trying to smile. I do like Angel's food cakes, but I really wanted to try a brownie. We sold out before I got a taste. Well, you can't have your cake and eat it too, said Miss Edwards. What good is having a cake if you can't eat it, said Amelia Bedelia. Good point, said Miss Edwards. She cut the cake into seven slices. Even slices. Even, even slices. Yes, slice all the cake evenly. Even size. Means same size. Everyone enjoyed the treat. This time they could have their cake and eat it too. Surprise for life. Sur support our library. Support our library. All four mm. books. books. This is a good book. Having a bake sale is not only super fun, it's just a piece of cake. Just ask Camellia Bedelia and her friends. The end. Bye.